replace their windows, one of the big things they're trying to accomplish is efficiency. Obviously, they want to have the lowest utility bills they can have and conversely, the most comfortable home they can have and that boils down to efficiency. What contributes to the efficiency, and this is kind of a complicated answer, is it's not just the la layers of glass. For instance, we're a triple glass company, but there are other companies that sell triple glass, and then the vast majority of companies sell double glass. It's not just the glass, it's the coatings that they put on the glass. And this is where different companies will try to trick up homeowners and like, oh, ours is the good one, or this is that. So I just, to very briefly explain this, three panes of glass, it, it's not the glass that's the insulator. It's the dead air spaces in between the glass that, that, that are the insulators. On a double glass window, you have one dead air space. On a triple glass window, you have two dead air spaces. So you have two layers instead of one for insulation. So that slows the conduction of hot and cold through, through the glass. And so just getting into more technical than I probably should, heat comes through a window. If it's a single pane of glass, it comes through almost instantaneously. If it's a double pane of glass, it takes longer, but it still comes through pretty fast. If it's a triple pane of glass, where you have two dead air spaces, it comes through, but it doesn't come through as fast. But then there's technology that they put in the glass, there's gases that they put in between the, the, uh, in the dead air spaces, and that slows the transfer of hot and cold through those spaces. Then there's a tinting put on the glass called low E, which stands for low emissivity, and that's a heat reflective tint. So like in the summer, it reflects the heat out, in the winter, it reflects the heat in. And so it's the combination of all these things. Like there are double glass windows that will say, we're 12 layers of low E tint and argon gas and da 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 da. Well, the more layers of low E tint, that is better. But a super, super efficient double glass window will never compare to the super, super efficient of a triple glass window, simply because a triple glass window has a additional layer of insulation, where a double glass window only has one, a triple glass has two. And then with a triple glass window, since we have two dead air spaces, we can charge both of those dead air spaces with gas. In our case, it's argon gas. And so that's two argon gas charge pa panels, rather than just one, which is what a double glass would be. Then we have three panes of glass. Most window companies have two panes of glass, so they're having low E either on one surface of glass, and in some cases, the more expensive windows, they'll put it on both surfaces of glass. In our case, we have three panes of glass, so we have three coats of low E. And so between three coats of low E, two dead air spaces, two gas-charged air spaces of argon, triple glass is much more efficient. But the reason why most companies stop at double glass is most frames aren't designed to carry the weight of three panes of glass. Just to be very honest, most frames barely support the weight of two panes of glass properly, much less a third. And so that's why uh, most companies, again, are trying to sell double glass. Well, I've done this since 1989, and I always tell people when I, when I was in the home selling, I used to sell against storm windows. There were companies that sold storm windows, which, you know, this will make your home more efficient, you're putting a storm window in, which in reality, it did very little. Well, nobody in, in our market and anywhere that I'm aware of sells storm windows anymore. It's just, it does nothing. And in most building codes and neighborhoods and municipalities are, you have to have at least double glass now because the efficiency difference from that and a single glass window with a storm is dynamic. And so ultimately what I'm trying to say is, as we keep moving more and more efficient and energy conservation becomes more and more real, everybody's eventually going to sell triple glass, except we've been doing this from the start and they're just finally catching up to us.